Today we're bringing back another ball python genetic quiz. Everyone can play along as I go through it. I'll explain the rules here in just a moment. This is the second one we've done and I think we might actually make this a semi-regular thing. It's also a really great way to practice identifying genes and that's the really key thing here. It's fun to play along but as a breeder if you wanted to start working new things there's never anything wrong with getting more practice and identifying things and why not make it fun while doing so. So here are the rules. One point for every visual gene guessed correctly. No points for guessing hets because you can't see them so it's kind of pointless. You must guess super when relevant. So for example if I say pastel but it ended up being super pastel well I'm not going to get even a single point for that. Guessing established combo names like Pompeii is allowed and for the most part I will be provided the pairing and I think this is really important because without the pairing it's sometimes impossible depending on what it is. I've often seen people come to bigger established breeders tables and ask them what they think this was and they give a guess and they're like no it's not that and then they actually like told me later that they couldn't believe that this big breeder didn't guess it and like well if you didn't give them the pairing I mean you're just pulling straws out of a hat so I definitely think that when you are breeding you should know your pairings so with that said let's go ahead and get started with the challenge all right, so we're starting off with three genes. Does clown count as one gene to you? Yes. So if it's a recessive for the sake of simplicity it is just one gene? Alrighty, it looks like we have a fire red stripe spot nose ivory DG clown to an Enchi leopard doublehead DG clown. Well, first things first, we know it's yellow belly. Ivory was in one of the pairings. It has to pass yellow belly on. It's definitely not clown. I don't think it's DG. Now, I don't work DG ironically, so I'm not a perfect in that. I do think that it is Enchi, and I think that it's. Man, this could be fire. Yeah, I think it's an Enchi fire yellow belly. What else could be in this? There's a leopard. No, I'm gonna stick with Enchi on that. The Tiger striping, although it, see there's little hints of lots of this stuff here. I don't think it's red stripe, although I could be wrong. Yeah, I'm gonna go fire, yellow bellies for sure, and Enchi. I could be really wrong here. Enchi, yellow belly, fire. No, I was right. I was 100% right. The leopard can throw little things in there, but this looks more tiger stripey, and leopard seems to bolden blacks, and this just seems very light. And Enchi, fire, and yellow belly all kind of create this nice little citrus look. So, on to the next pairing, which is a blackhead hypo het clown to a lesser fire yellow belly het clown. Again, it is not a clown. It cannot be a hypo because it's not going to anything with hypo in it. So, that it can only be possibly blackhead, lesser fire, or yellow belly. I think we can say it's lesser. I think we're gonna find that it is blackhead and then I am just caught on the fire or the yellow belly. I think I'm gonna go fire. I don't see in uh, there's some stuff with yellow belly. I'm gonna go fire. Heck with it. Ready, set, go. Lesser blackhead fire. I was right. I'm perfect so far. Oh man, I had to say that. Oh, okay. Cypress yellow belly clown. Could you have gotten a better picture? I see its head and maybe 15 to 20% of the snake on this picture. Anyways, Cypress yellow belly clown to an Anchi banana het clown. All right, well, we know it's a clown, not a banana. Banana is obvious, right? So it's Cypress yellow belly or Anchi. There is not enough for me to see here. I'm gonna go Anchi. I don't think it's Cypress. There's just not enough picture here. I think everyone should get full credit for this round, period. Extra points if they get it actually correct. Like I said, clown, Anchi. It could be Cypress. But I'm gonna go yellow belly. Clown and she yellow belly. It says Cypress. I'm getting full credit and so are you. But if you got it all correct, you get an extra point. That's how this works. Banana Sable GHI Yellow Belly to a Super Enchi Lesser. It's not Lesser, it is Enchi because it's a Super Enchi, it has to be. It's not Banana, which leaves Sable, GHI, and Yellow Belly on the table. I don't believe it's GHI, it'd be one of the lower expression ones, which means it's Sable Yellow Belly. I don't work Sable enough to really know. Yellow Belly, I believe, because of those sides. So Enchi, Sable, Yellow Belly, final answer for myself. Enchi Sable Yellow Belly. Next up would be a Fire Red Stripe Spot Nose Ivory DG Clown to an Enchi. We did this one. I'm gonna go back with this, right? I can go back. Yeah, you can go back. It looks this, the pose and everything's the same. Is this from the same? It's from the rice, isn't it? Anyways, I'm pretty sure the pairing was the same. So this is definitely the sibling of the same one you did earlier. Scum. Anyway, Fire Red Stripe Spot Nose Ivory DG Clown to an Enchi Leo Double Head DG Clown. It's not clown. I do think this one is DG. So take a look at the difference between this. They're both very bright and nice and clean. Part of that is also in testament to how amazing rice reptiles quality of animals are, which is a thing, by the way. You can have different quality of the same gene. Anyways, when you see there, it's just a little more creamy. So I'm going to say it's DG. Fire. It has to be yellow belly, actually. So maybe it's not fire. Is it Enchi? Yeah. It almost looks like it could be Firefly. So I would admit immediately say like pastel in any other case but it's not in there so I think it will be Enchi though again I'm kind of caught between Leo but no those stripes are there I'm gonna go DG yellow belly and Enchi 
DG Yellow Belly Inchi. I did get it. This boy, obvious brother of the other one. Yep, I was right. It's from Rice. Just kind of got an eye for looking at some of these people's things and also the pairings. Clearly the same. Moving along. Oh, four jeans. Same thing, just more jeans to guess. So, special Yellow Belly Fire Red Stripe Clown to a Hurricane Head Clown. Hurricane Clowns do have crazy eye stripes. It brings them back in that specific combo. They're thick and they're fat, but they still have other unique things to their head and it's a different kind of eye stripe. It's very obvious that what you're looking at is different. Therefore, I do not believe this to be a clown. I do, however, think it's a hurricane. I think it's red stripe. Ooh, I don't know what that one. These are four jeans, right? Yes. Hurricane, special, yellow belly. I think yellow belly. Maybe not. I work fire in yellow belly and red stripe, but not in these combos. Lots of granulation there. Some oranging in there, though. What else would bring the oranging? I don't know if a hurricane does that. I don't think it does. I'm gonna go hurricane, red stripe, special. Is it fire or yellow belly, though? My gut says yellow belly, but my eye says fire. I'm gonna go with my gut and stick yellow belly in there. So hurricane, did I say red stripe special? Said hurricane special yellow belly red stripe. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna go with. I could be off on other than the hurricane, honestly. Well, like statistically, I can't be completely off. Special red stripe, yellow belly fire. It doesn't have hurricane. I thought with all that craziness that that's what was bringing in the granulation. I don't work it enough. I mean, I love them. And I saw the little bit of effect to the eye stripes. That's what threw me off, I think. So I missed one. It was fire instead of hurricane. Next up, the pairing was a black pastel leopard, yellow belly hypo DG to a orange dream pastel inchy spot nose clown head hypo. The aspect in the background is a little blurry. So this could be a super pastel. So let's put that down. I do think it's a leopard. I don't think Orange Dream. Don't think NG. I think it's Spot Nose. Yeah, actually, looking at the head, I think it's Spot Nose. I don't think it's Hypo, even though that's a potentiality. Where does that leave? Black Pastel and Yellow Belly? Man, I could be way off here. And NG too, but I don't think it's NG. It might not even be a Super Pastel, but I think it is. I don't think what else could be tag teaming with that. No, I think it's a Super Pastel Spot Nose Leopard, and I gotta go Yellow Belly on this one. Wait a second, I almost screwed up. It says black pastel and I read it as black pastel and then I just reread pastel. I almost made a grave error. I kind of mentioned it might not be super, it's just its head is pretty darn blushed. It cannot be, because it's just black pastel, leopard, yellow belly, hypo, DG. I almost made a mistake. So I'm just gonna get rid of the super and just leave pastel. Ready? Let's go. Pastel Leopard Spot Nose Orange Dream. And I think they meant to say Het because they marked it down there for the DG. What did I miss then? I didn't guess Orange Dream. You guessed Yellow Belly instead. Okay, that was one I was kind of just tossing in there anyways, but yeah, it's hard to see with the rest of that and the picture is a little bit blurry, but again, only missed one. All right, this is a Pastel Chocolate Orange Dream DG puzzle to a Mojave Het puzzle. This is a puzzle. It's kind of got like that undertone of being dark, but also being washed out. So I'm gonna say it's chocolate. It's phenomenal. The puzzle project is so cool. And then I'm gonna say, what did I say? Chocolate, yeah, I don't think it's pastel because that head is still pretty dark. Instead, I think it is Orange Dream and Mojave. So there's my four, Puzzle, Chocolate, Orange Dream, Mojave. It's still got that darker undertone to it. Like you look at the head and such. And yes, it's a little faded because of Mojave. It's kind of got that frosty type undertone. It almost looks like it is a dark snake that has a little bit of frost ganging on it. What else did I say? Chocolate, Orange Dream, Puzzle, and Mojave. Yeah, and it's obviously Puzzle, the pattern. Moving along. Puzzle Mojave, or sorry, past, Pastel, instead of Orange Dream. Oh, I saw the orangey type sides and it was just like Orange Dream. And the head is just pretty dark. Ball Python should have known what they're talking about. And Orange Dream is definitely a more sought after gene, so I'll go with them there. Next up would be a Yellow Belly Leopard Clown Het Pied to a Spot Nose Clown. This should be theoretically easy just for math. If we've got four genes, Clown, it's obvious. Can't be Pied because it's only Het Pied. It is most definitely a Spot Nose with all that niceness going on in the head. And therefore Leopard and Yellow Belly, by the standards of knowing that there's only four genes here. It's a Batman yellow belly. It really brings in a nice little tinge to it. And yeah, very nice. Yeah, yellow belly Batman. Next up would be a orange dream yellow belly inchy pied. Spread to a super high intensity orange dream fire het pied 50% het lavender albino. So there's nothing with the lavender albino for one. It's not even in the other pairing. Pied was in the pairing, but I don't see that. Although there are some crazy high pattern pieds. It's gotta be orange dream because there's a super high intensity orange dream. And quite frankly, I'm gonna say it's a super. In fact, actually, I think it's gonna be super OD YB enchi fire. If I don't think it's a pied, that's what it's gotta be. And I do not think it's a pied. There's just too much going on in the dorsal there. It would be a little more wild. You'd have some peaking here and there. I've had two pieds that were all patterned. They were super inchy pieds. They had to be pieds because it was pied to pied. So I know kind of what I'm looking for when it comes to a full pattern pied. All right. ODYB inchy fire. Got it. Well, um, just OD. Mother of God. Alrighty, whatever. This is just an OD. It's not a super orange dream.
five jeans now. Let's go ahead and get started with this pastel chocolate orange dream DG puzzle to a fire inchy het DG. I do think we're looking at a firefly, which is fire and pastel. I do think we're looking at a desert ghost. It's very clean. Can't be a puzzle. It's not on the other pairing. And then I guess it would be enchi and then chocolate. It's pretty dark in certain spots, but that could be because of the DG. But I mean, what else do I have? I literally don't have anything else. Well, it could be orange dream. Ooh, it could be. It has darkness in certain spots, but I just, I think... Do I want to go chocolate or do I want to go orange dream? There's some orange peeking at the bottom there, but that could be the Enchi. Man, I've seen it go both ways. This one's got me stumped. I'm going to go orange dream just to move it along here. You got all five of them? Fire, pastel, DG, Enchi, OD. I could be wrong on that last one. I probably am. I was. Wait, what? Chocolate, Enchi, OD, pastel, DG. Fire was the extra one. So I missed fire and then I missed the other one. Okay, so that's the most I've missed so far. That looks like a firefly, but then again, DGs look really nice. So I think I just went into that realm and just didn't think about it because I was more focused on whether it was Orange Dream or chocolate and I already picked it. So I just kind of stuck between the two. I'm not even thinking like, oh yeah, it does look like both for a specific reason. That was a mess up from hurrying. I literally said I thought it could be either one. Well, it was both. So I got three. So what was it again? The chocolate Enchi Orange Dream Pastel Desert Ghost. Did I get four? You got Pastel Desert Ghost Enchi OD. Oh yeah, I guess I guessed it. And the it's only just one you missed was chocolate. I've, yeah, I only missed one then. Orange Dream Yellow Belly Fire Enchi to a Butter Leopard. Butter is very similar to Lesser, but our friends at RGI have recently confirmed that it is its own gene. There's six genes. It's everything but one. It has to be Orange Dream Yellow Belly Fire Enchi Butter and Leopard. Almost looks like a genetic stripe. I think it's butter. It's Orange Dream. It's Yellow Belly. It's fire. I think the odd one out here is whether it's inchy or leopard then. Just a little bit of pattern there on the side right there, but I just don't know. It really looks like a genetic stripe. The head is bladed though. Enchi heads are bladed like this, but then again, Orange Dream can do it too. However, Orange Dream and Enchi together kind of combined. It's not a super, but it can make it feel like one in a way. So I'm going to go Enchi. Orange Dream, Yellow Belly, Fire, Enchi, and Butter. My clue is that bladed head of Enchi over Leopard. Ready? Go. Orange Dream, Lesser, Leopard, mm. Yellow Belly, Enchi. What is it not? See, yeah, again, I was thrown off by something. Fire, fire is the one. Again, I missed it. Yeah, I guess I get it. So I missed one again on that, but I was right on thinking with the Enchi at least. So see where I was kind of identifying certain things. This one would be very difficult for me to identify Leopard. I mean, look at a Batman, for example, when you get Leopard and Spot Nose together. Kind of cleans up the sides and leaves just a few little dots on a Batman, which is a clown, Leopard and Spot Nose. So definitely see that. All right. Ooh, a Wookie, Red Stripe, Leopard, Head Clown to an Anchi Pastel Fire Spot Nose Head Clown. I don't think it's a clown because of the eye stripes there. I do think Anchi. I do think Spot Nose. I do think Leopard. <laughs> I don't want to forget you, Fire again. Burned me twice. I'm going to say Fire. And it gives it that faded type of look and I keep missing. So what are we between now? What did I say? Anchi, Spot Nose, Leopard, Fire. I didn't say Pastel. You did not. It kind of gives that Firefly type glow to it though. That's why I want to say like a Pastel. And then that makes me think it could be something else because why would it? pattern be so crazy if it's just a leopard enchi pastel fire spot nose man i feel like i'm missing something there enchi pastel fire spot nose leopard i just i don't know i don't know about the red strip or the wookie right now red strip can be very subtle wookie i just don't know it could be i feel like i'm gonna regret rushing this one but i'm gonna just i'm gonna mail that one in enchi pastel fire spot nose and leopard Yep, I was wrong. Enchi, Fire, Red Stripe, Spot Nose, Wookie. So I missed two. I missed Pastel. This seems pretty light to me, but hey, the Fire can maybe bring that in. And then Wookie and Red Stripe. I knew that those could have been in there, but that was a tough one. I don't work Wookie. I do work Red Stripe, but I don't think actually I've bred it yet. I'm mad at myself for that one. Next up, this animal was created from a pairing of a Pastel, Enchi, Super Asphalt. That's important. Leopard, Phantom, Yellow Belly. So we know it's an Asphalt. Leopard, Enchi, Pastel, and Phantom. That's what I'm going to go with because I don't think this is a freeway. freeway is the combination of asphalt and yellow belly. So pastel, enchi, asphalt, leopard, and then just by process of elimination, since I don't think this is a freeway, it's a phantom, even though I know not as much about that. Ready? Go. Leopard, Phantom, Pastel, Inchy, Asphalt. I got it, right? Yes. Yeah. Next up, this pairing was a Pastel, Inchy, Spot Nose Clown to a Lesser Barnhart Black Pastel Het Clown. Barnhart Black Pastel is a really, really awesome genetic. It is not the same as Black Pastel, although it is in the same family and is therefore allelic and will create an animal that is, guess what? Pretty much the same thing as a Super Black Pastel. I don't think it's a clown though. If it's five genes, that makes this pretty easy again. It's very light and I think that's from the Lesser coming in. So Lesser is my first thing. Pastel, which 
which kind of explains why it's so bright. And she spot nose and then Barnhart Black Pastel could explain the little bit of the darker, but there's a lot of light coming in here. The spot nose, see how the head is just kind of crazy and yeah, they, they can have these little spots on their nose, although things like pastel can make that difficult to tell. But yeah, pattern's kind of crazy. So that says Enchi all over the place. Spot nose can smash the pattern a little bit too. And then underneath that, it's kept from washing out completely by that Barnhart Black Pastel though. So, all right. Enchi, Lesser, Pastel, Spot Nose, Barnhart Black Pastel. I got them right? Yep. Sweet. I'm doing pretty good. Oh, said I'm doing pretty good. Now it's the finale. All right. Oh boy, I've seen this one. Dang it. Double points. Six jeans in this. Man, I've seen this. I've seen this. I've seen this. I've seen this. I wonder if it's, I don't think it's a Pompeii combo, is it? No, I think this is a hurricane because look at the stripes. Hurricane Clown. Cypress? Dang it, I'm gonna get mad. Spot nose, yellow belly. It's got some nice lavender type looks. What would bring that in? I don't think it's a banana. But then again, there's a crazy combo. Could it be? Oh man, since I don't know the combo, I'm like now seeing this in a different light. I don't, is it? I've seen some crazy ones, but there's some lavenders there. At first I didn't see it, but now I'm starting to think that it might be. Man, I don't know. I'm gonna get mad. I'm gonna pick it. I'm gonna, now I can't get that out of my head. I'm at five, right? You have hurricane, clown, spot nose, cypress, yellow belly. Okay, I'm pretty happy with those picks for not knowing a thing. It's got some lavenders there, and while I originally just see this as an orange animal, I think it might be because of the lavenders. That's what first cued me onto it, the lavenders and those colors, and I'm like, what would bring that in? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna mail it in banana. I could be super way off on that, and it's gonna look, see, I don't know, I don't know. What else would bring the lavenders? There's, there's something else. I'm just gonna see it, and I'm gonna go, dang it. It would be so cool if I got this. I gotta stick with it, otherwise I'll be here forever. I, nothing's coming to my mind. My mind is blocked. Every I wish I hadn't thought of banana right now because now I can't get that out of my brain. I can't go anywhere else with it. I'm gonna just hit enter. I got it! I got it all? Oh, calico. Dude, I got all but one. Banana, hurricane, spot nose, calico, yellow belly clown. What did I say instead of that? Cypress. Cypress. I am super proud of myself. I saw this. Let me go back because it blows it up there. You see that right there, the whites? It actually almost threw me off a banana. And I was just like, maybe it's not banana. These whites coming up, that's the calico. But I'm not mad at my guess with Cypress because of the colors that this brings in. Heck yeah, I'm proud of myself on that one. Anyways, how did you do? Let us know in the comments below. If you like this video, check out our last challenge right here here.